Yo, what up guys? Welcome back. Today I'll be doing a legit review. This time I'll be doing a review of another Razer product. Last time I did the Razer Kraken and the video is here. I'm doing a review of the Razer Kraken Pros. Today I'll be doing a review of the Smart Band by Razer, the Razer Nabu X, which is the like budget version I guess, which is the cheaper version. There's like a Nabu who has like a display and all that crap. But today I'll be doing a review of the cheaper alternative, the Razer Nabu X. Now I'll be going over four things. I'll be going over the app compatibility, level of comfort on your wrist, um, the bang for your buck, you know, what you're, get, what you're getting for what you're buying. And at the very end, I'm just going to do a final conclusion and basically just explain why you should or shouldn't buy this smartwatch and, uh, or smart band, whatever this thingy is, really. It's like a, not even a watch, it's like a band thingy, three dots thingy. See, you got three dots there. But yeah, anyway, I hope you guys like this video. And if you do, if it's informative, please smash that like button down below and be sure to subscribe for more videos. Anyway, let's get right into the review. So let's start off by determining the level of comfort you'll get by wearing the Nabu X. I wore it for about one and a half days straight, and after about a half a day, my wrist became a little annoyed by the Nabu being there, but I don't really think that's the cause of the band itself. I think it was really just me. In terms of what the band is made of, it's made of this synthetic plastic synth silicone material that really feels quite soft to touch, although if you sweat with it on, it can get a little ir irritating after a while. I actually went to the gym with it once and it just got a little a little bit irritating, not gonna lie. The wristband, several uh, size notches offer plenty of wrist sizes to choose from and it's not too tight nor too loose on your wrist, so no worries there. Moving on to the band that comes with the wristband, I felt that it could have definitely be improved upon and because of the fact that there is no numeric display on the Nabu, an improvement on its app would definitely help future Razer uh, smartwatch buyers since of course there is no display, you can't really read anything on it. I felt as if there was a lackluster Bluetooth connection to my phone as I constantly had to repair the connection every time I went to go see statistics, although sometimes it actually connected and I was like, hooray! In terms of the accuracy of the technology inside of the Anabu X, I felt that it really also could be improved upon, maybe for future models, but seeing as though this model of the, of the smart band is only about $25, at least where I come from, I don't see it getting any, any future models that improve upon the current one. Uh, I also felt as if the technology tracking steps, like the pedometer inside of it, and sleep uh, tracking itself was a little cheap because I could actually be in class for about an hour and barely move my wrist with my smartwatch on it and at the end of the class had plus 600 steps than from the beginning of the class even though clearly I hadn't even been moving that much. Finally, I'll just include my price versus what you get here in my final conclusion. All in all, you get an extremely comfortable wristband with meh sleep tracking and meh step tracking paired with a three dot display which is not super convenient for someone who was looking for a watch for $25. Honestly, I would look for something maybe a little better that might cost another 10 maybe 20 maybe $30 even, like the Fitbit or really anything else. I have also found that it became increasingly irritating having this band on my wrist but no watch, since you really expect there to be a watch there when you turn your wrist and look at it. Anyways, for $25, I would save up and buy something with better hardware and probably software as well. If you found this review helpful, you can hit that like button below and be sure to subscribe for more high quality videos. Anyway guys, see ya!